The Pacific International Hospital is set to build the first renal transplant facility for the country. In an interview with NBC's Current Affairs program, PNG Tonight, PIH Chief Executive Officer Dr. Pisho Pujari said they are keen to help cut the costs involved for Papua New Guineans. The hospital currently only offers dialysis treatment. Rebecca Passingen reports. Kidney complication is a lifestyle disease. In the past, it was unheard of, but recently, because of the changing lifestyle, it has seen a rise. This has also seen a demand for kidney dialysis in a worst-case scenario, a kidney transplant. This service is unavailable in the country. Currently, only a few facilities offer kidney dialysis service. The PNG Kidney Foundation does it for free while the Pacific International Hospital offers the service for 1,000 kinape hemodialysis treatment. But the hospital is keen to build a kidney transplant facility. It may take some time, but we have a vision to put it, uh, introduce it in the interest of the PNGs. And it plans to build it very soon. And we need to establish the isolation facility for the uh, transplant surgery done uh, patients to maintain them. So. At this moment, we are in touch with some doctors, overseas doctors. We are exploring the idea, you know, if they can come here on a visiting basis and establish the unit, and over the period of time, they can come as a full-time. Rebecca Passingan, NBC National News, Port Mosby.